Hello my fellow hunters and huntresses, welcome back to the lodge, I'm your host Game Hunter and welcome to a start of another new series, this time The Beast Inside. It's only just been released today and it's been on my wish list for quite, wish list for quite a while. So it's, it is a horror game so I thought it would be perfect for Halloween month. And I don't like the sound of that door opening but so I expect a few jumps and a few scary bits I don't normally play games like this but because of the time of year I thought why not so let's get into it and see what it's all about yes we'll have it on standard here we go chapter one the beginning so it's supposed to be that you play two characters one from the normal present time and one from a different century they're both interlinked into the same story somehow so that'll be interesting to find out what goes on so let's get cracking One week earlier. So let's say we can change our fate. Nineteen <laughs> sixties type theme song, that's quite good. God, mate, it does look beautiful that house. you got a nice little thing outside, look. Here we go. So move chapter one. Take the box into the house. Which box is that? You're going to be these boxes on there. Voice recorder. Press B to check the voice recorder. Adam uses the voice recorder to record conversation. His thoughts on the current events. Okay. 
So it looks like it gives you hints about what to do next, so we've got to take the boxes inside the house. So we open the door, and we can upstairs we go. And which table is that, I wonder? That this one. There you go. Let's have a quick look at this. Got something here. Simon Sons moving service. Moving day out blah blah blah. Pick up address delivery to blah blah blah. Eight of eight to ten boxes, blah blah blah. So we'll take that. Now right, let's go and fetch the other ones. So what's this one? We've got to take them all upstairs. That's two. So it's a nice little job just to start us off. What we've got on this one? That's kitchen stuff. So we're sorry we'll be taking that upstairs. Let's see if we can find the kitchen. That's definitely not the kitchen. Let's just put that down on here for a moment. I had an idea of some. Let's have a read this then. I had an idea of some. This house belonged to our family for many decades. Some called it the Stevens. Some even called it the Stevenson's Refuge, but when you, me and your dad moved to Boston, we thought Grandpa was just going to sell it as he said he would. Well, he didn't, surprise me. He left this in his will, and now you and your lovely wife will live here, raise your kids, and simply enjoy life far away from the turmoil of a dangerous time. I can't even imagine a better place to settle down. Take good care of Emma. We'll visit you sometime next month if my aged hip allows that. Mom. P.S. Dad thinks he should be the one to come up with a f name for your son and daughter. I have no idea why he's insisting on that. Maybe he's just getting old and tries to leave out kind of legacy, blah blah blah. Okay, so we'll take that. Let's see if we can find the kitchen. That's not a kitchen, is it? We one of these ones. No, that one's locked. That one's locked. Okay, it's fair enough. So we'll just put them in this room then. Money. Got out. I should read this too so I can get it on the of Emma and their quirks. Okay. <laughs> right, let's go get the other boxes in. Another kitchen one, so we'll put it on top of that one. Simple enough. That's our sweep. So these are just like where they've jumped out there. Nothing, like all our stuff just been dumped. Now just put this one on there. Right, that's that job done. Shut the door. So we've done that. Let's see if we could explore a bit up here. No, that's locked. Nice bedroom.
She already got in the shower. So that's locked. Uh huh, I see, that's why it's lighting up. I think we've got to put them on that one. Okay, so now we need to get their paint. Nice. We go. Oh great. Find the key in the dining room, right? So it's gotta be down here somewhere. <laughs> so I said. Alright, checking that one? No. There's something saved for this, but I'm not going to say it. <laughs> Search the car, so we can't get in the trunk. Let's open the door. Alright, so that's popped the trunk. Let's have a look where it is. So what am I looking for? Just keep putting these down here. Right, where is this damn key? Uh huh, so we don't have to move the boxes. Just need the key. So we'll take that. Those are different things. There we go. Right. Let's get to this attic then, shall we? And get some paint. Nothing too scary about this, is it? Find the paint. So we've got this. I wonder who they belong to, Grandma or somebody else. Oops. Right, where's the paint? Is that paint? No. Someone must have hit them really hard to make this. Oh great, so we've got a fill of paint with blood on. Right, let's stop examining that, find some paint. Is this ginger paint? Don't know what the hell that is. Looks like paint lids. Right, paint, paint, paint. What does it look like? Aha, uh -huh, I see it. There we go. So I've got to find the crowbar. See if up here. Bingo! 
Anything in there? No. Might as well check, aren't we? Might as well get this up. Come on. What the hell? It's got a puzzle on it anyway. Not going to be something as simple as my name, is it? No. Rotate the objects to find hidden messages. Find to reveal the message. G C Julius Caesar Snitchel. Why? J equals C. When examining this mode is on, you can perform additional interactions with certain objects. Got J there, so not if you go like J around here. So you got T. E. Julius, that's L. Got to do so. Julius, so you got T. It's not T. It's not Z either. Aha! Uh -huh, wait a minute. Or something there, so what have we got? So M H P M H P If J equals C, then based on the letter, the first character in the cipher should be P, so then A M. So is that going to be the code? M H P A O Are we sure it was an A? Let's just get out again. MHP AM. Now, unless we've got to use a disk for that. So if we go to. So if we go to M, you get D. So what's that H 
H you get Y and you go to P oh no that's right, go to P you get G and you go to A you get R and go to O That, that's F. But okay, let's see if we get them later then. So, What the hell? I'm not getting this at all. Some characters in Caesar's letter look different. If I can find them all. Why did someone know what they leak? I'm not getting this at all. I don't understand what I've got to do. So now I found the letters, but if it all moves, how does that work? I mean if you go to M you gotta get M. Now if you get Julius you get M and you get U that's R. Gives you F. No, this don't look right at all. Then you got S. Now gives you P. There's no P in it either, is it?
Oh my god. I don't know if you any bloody hints how to crack it. First, I'll put the letter J over C, and I should be able to decide that the other is B. It's probably about those distinguishing letters that seem to fuck it. Right. I need to put J over C. Alright. So now you gotta look for the U. And gives you N. I oh, no, look at them other letters, that's what it means, doesn't it? So you look for M, M. Gives you F. So you've got J, F. And look for H. Gives you A. P. Gives you I and A gives you T and then O gives you H. So that could be it. Right. Here we go. Right, let's try this. F A I T H Faith. Huh. Jesus. I suppose we're not gonna be that complicated. So we've got a key. Oh, that, what could that unlock? So that could be open a door. And so I've got a diary. Then that's the other character. Okay, September 27th, in the year of our Lord, 1864. Also, oh, already moving on to chapter 2. This is September 27th, in the year of our Lord, 1864, evening, almost night. Never before have I kept a diary, but they say that it might be a change for me to reclaim the memories I have lost. Besides, writing did tales of clarity of thought makes it easy to distinguish facts from imagination. Yeah, so this is the other character. I knew we were playing two characters, so it looks like in the 18th, 1864, we play as Nicholas. And that guy with a sword don't look too inviting, does he? Right, let's crack on. It is September 27th, in the year of our Lord, 1874. Evening, almost Never before have I kept a diary, but they say that it might be a chance for me to reclaim the memories of the people. Writing in tales of clarity of thought makes it easier to distinguish facts from imagination. I'm home again after ten years of absence. I believe to find the house and escape. That's good. It's the only roof I have over my head for now. I should 
lights and candles. No trace of my father. I honestly think he would welcome me at the door. Feel free to read it down and just write down his thoughts as well as important information. That's some more matches, yeah. It was a gift from my father's partner, George, as far as I remember. Fate played a cool trick on him back when I was a kid. It still gives me the creeps. So we've got another one there. Got a note. Okay, this is starting to get a bit eerie now. So we've got an old photograph. Main push moves heavy, so we could move every object. Another candle. The hell? Upstairs. My father knew what was hidden underneath. He just needs someone with a cool of open mind. Oh, good. Starting to get a bit to me. What the hell was that noise? Oh, we've got no lights. Let's light some candles. Don't like being in the dark. Can I pick these up? Yeah, I don't think it was that, mate. Right, some candles up here. Oh, oh, oh dear. My grandfather, yeah, will definitely take that. Oh, surely we aren't going to go outside. Oh my god. Where the hell did he go? Exactly. Hey! You still here? I mean, you better take a look. We don't need to take... Jesus Christ.
Why do we need to go outside? Yeah, you can get knotted too, bird. Oh. The hell? Oh, it's just the wind. <laughs> Some bolt cutters. We'll take them. Nice. Now let's see what's inside. Oh no 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 no. There we go. Rotate. Terrible crime shot the peaceful local community. Called in confirm the man's death, John Norman. Oh my god. So they're saying it was sectional brutal, so it looks like someone. First, I want them to get some matches. Oh, this is getting a bit weird now. Come on, let's get in. Don't like being out here. What the hell? Excuse me, mate, can you just move off? <laughs> Come on. What? You let yourself in? Hey, are you deaf? I'm talking to you. No, don't make him angry, mate. Oh, for the love of God. Is he laughing? Oh! Shit! I might end up in an asylum before this is over. This is crackers. Right, basement. Where will the basement be? Not through there, is it through here? No. But it's not going to be upstairs, is it? So. Oh, no. Come on. Ah, some more kerosene, we need that. Can I get through there? Oh, shit! Oh, dear. No, I don't want that. It's reminding me of layers of fear all over again. And that music's not helping. Right guys, we're going to have to end it shortly because it's 40 minutes now, but just want to see what happens when we get into the basement.
even though I'm not going to like it. Oh, we've got blood. No more matches. That's locked, so yep, we've got to go into the. Exactly. What in God's name is happening? Oh, for the love of God. Oh my God. Why have we got to open it? <laughs> it's not a good idea mate I'm telling you that now what don't you get you got blood on the walls on the floors oh my god why did I agree to play this game Follow the blood trail? No, I don't want to. So, matches. Finding a more killer scene. Why would I want to throw it? Can I read it? In Hillside, so it used to be an inn. My father's in first ever time. And... <laughs> I don't want to. Oh my god. I want to go home. No, I don't want you. Want the matches? Yeah, I think so tonight. Keep forgetting to check for them. So the blood's going. Is it in here? No. Oh, I hate this game. Please, please. Oh my god. Oh, it's getting worse. Oh no. Find the side entrance. What's that? Shears. We'll take the shears. Take them. We gotta go back. Have to get in there. Whatever happened. I hope it's not my father's thing. Oh! Oh! My. Oh! Dear God. I want help. Right, guys. I'm just gonna get back up here and then I'll give it a save. Oh! Oh no 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 I need to get rid of before I 
place. Can I just use the shears? Please let me out. He's upstairs. He doesn't want from me. Right guys, I'm gonna leave it here. Uh, 46 minutes now, so thank you very much for joining me for this first episode. I'm scared. I feel like I'm gonna crap myself, but I look forward to seeing you back in the second episode, but for now, thank you and goodbye.